to the, the family of Mother Dorothy Giles. We extend our deepest sympathy at this time <coughs> in your art bereavement. We said uh, two minutes, I have one minute. I, I sat back there and tried to reflect on life of Mother Giles. I met her back on Saratoga Avenue. Okay. Right. It had to be 1975, 1976 maybe. That's it was a long time. Yes, amen. I, I knew this pastor when she was young. <laughs> I was in this church before most of you were born. Yeah. We go back a long way. So many things you know, came in my mind about Mother Giles. And to be honest, if I would say some of the things that come to my mind, I would be hurt. Back in the 70s, there used to be a uh, a. A. Allen, he was one of the big crusaders and other evangelists in, in the United States. And he had a team, uh, Reverend Little John and Jean, uh, Jean, uh, Jean Martin. There we go. And one of the crusade major teams was everybody talk about heaven. Ooh. Ain't gonna make it. Everybody talk about heaven. Ain't gonna make it in. Amen. Praise the Lord, everyone. God bless you. We honor our Lord and Savior Jesus Christ to the members of the clergy. Amen. To the family, we're definitely praying for you and to everyone that is here. We are here because we love Mother Giles. Amen. We thank God for the life of Mother Giles. Amen. And thank God growing up in Trinity, the fellowship between Trinity Zion and Pentecostal Rescue House of Prayer. One of the persons you all will see is Mother Giles. She was a she was a, pill, a pillar of the church. And we thank God for the life of Mother Giles. While I was sitting there, scripture came to mind, Revelation chapter 21 and verse number 5. And God shall wipe away all tears from their eyes. And there will be no more death, uh -huh. nor sorrow, yeah. nor crying, and no more pain for the former. That was that was the, of the former time, the former days. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So when we hear that Mother God, she went through some things, she experienced some pain, but now she's up in glory. Amen. And, and, and she's in a place that we are striving to get there. And the song says, "Get right, church. Let's go home." So to Mother Giles, amen, we love you, and we can't wait to see you in the morning. May God bless you to the family. We're praying for you. And church, let's continue to pray for the family as they go through. God bless you. Amen. Bless the Lord. I have just a quick insertion just before I call on the sister to sing. Uh, we are so blessed to have our elder Singletary here uh, from the south. Maryland, Maryland, amen, who came to give tribute, so we would not uh, be right if we did not honor him, amen. Praise the Lord, everybody. Praise the Lord, everybody. See, because this was not just mother, but this is mom to me. Mom adopted me into her family with my brother right here. I was the good son. <laughs> um, but, I, but I stand before you today because the lessons that she taught me were very important. I didn't know about holiness. And mama talked about holiness and talked about living right and just spreading the word. And I would make that trip with my brother to New York every weekend for many years just to be with mama. Even when he was sick, I would go to New York and pick up mama and bring her down. And I thank God for the opportunity and the life that she lived because it really means something. We don't have men and women of God now that really talk about the word of God, that really stand on the word of God, that set an example for the people of God. And mama was that place, that 
that person. She really set an example for it. And one of the things that I'm gonna make you laugh is mama would say, I don't understand this generation because they don't understand holiness. Because if the, the skirt wasn't down to the to the floor and there wasn't something on the head, you you wasn't living right. If you didn't tarry for the Holy Ghost, you weren't living right. And I tarried for the Holy Ghost. I that I was open. And I got the Holy Ghost. And I thank God for the life that she lived. I'm gonna miss her, but every sad moment is a glad moment for me because I shall see her again. I when the Lord cracks open the sky. I will be with my mom and I, we will celebrate and we will walk together and my brothers and my sisters we will join together and worship our almighty God thank you and bring my strength in the Lord Amen. Even outside of her family, yes, she yes. gathered family. Amen. So we thank God. At this time, we're going to have a solo. Amen. amen. From our Shalandra Jones. Let's receive her with a high amen. amen. She also came from South Carolina. Amen. Amen.
Thank you.